but then yeah so vitamin c has really up like taking my skincare to another level like i can see the difference like my skin is brighter vitamin c works go and get vitamin c hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be talking about glowy skin how to have a glowy skin so um well first of all a disclaimer i am not a dermatologist or any form of skin expert so whatever i'll be sharing in this video is something that has worked for me and has worked for people around me like i've um given suggestions to my sister my aunts they've tried these things and it yeah, works for them so i hope you will try it and it will work for you too so when it comes to skincare first thing that i would say is um there's no one size fits all kind of thing but then there are basics that is for everyone so what do i mean by that i mean what's one product that works for me might not necessarily work for your skin because we all have different skin types we have um normal combination oily dry skin you know all of those kind of skins that we have so what works for me might not work for you and that's perfectly fine but today i tell you guys about what has worked for me what has really helped me and i hope will help someone out here so the first thing i would want to say about skincare is that you have to be deliberate about it if you want to have a glowing skin if you want to have a clean skin you have to be deliberate like you have to be intentional you have to put in your the effort you can't just wish it it's not something you wish it's not something that will just because you wish it and then to just happen no you have to be deliberate about it you have to work hard you have to work towards having clean skin and then you'll be able to have that skin number two is that you have to be patient guys you have like if you have a if you buy a product that works for you in one week just be afraid of the product like because some of these especially all these products that um uh, work like so fast they definitely have um consequence they have effects on your skin um, in the long run so anything that you see you see seven days one week kind of all those magic stuff don't try to get them because those things they might seem like they're working but the results thereafter is going to be terrible that's why you have all these um local skincare products that you see people buy and then just one week they're all fair and then before you know they have some back scars somewhere some um white um, patches on their body and stuff like that so just try to avoid those things and another thing is that so i've noticed that now skincare is a big deal these days like everywhere all over the world and stuff like that and let's say like here in nigeria um there are a lot of skincare brands coming up new employment so people are trying to employ themselves and people try to create like they make they formulate um different products like from soap to cream all the black soaps all the creams whitening cream caramel cream and all of those things well all i can say is just be careful because you might just find yourself in the wrong hands so i've had um skin issues for a very long time um i used to well not i used to i still am i still have acne prone skin so any little thing can just yeah my skin can just go up so and one thing with skincare is that one well one thing with your skin is that once you have issues on your skin you tend to be conscious of it even when nobody's really paying attention you're conscious of it i had terrible skincare well that's not for another day i will tell you guys my acne journey but today i just want to talk about general skin having a healthy skin how to maintain a healthy skin so but then once you have a skincare issue you just tend to be conscious of that it's like oh oh this you know something wrong with me and all of those things and um you guys might be sorry there's there's a construction going on around my house so there's so much noise sorry about that but yeah so if you have 
skin issues you tend to be more conscious of your skin even when nobody's looking at you you're just being you're just worrying about it and all of that but anyway that aside um it's it's really not easy to just try to ignore that's just the truth even if you want to ignore it it's not that easy to ignore it like you just feel conscious of yourself all the time so but um all i can say is skincare is a conscious effort you have to be conscious you have to be intentional about your skin if you want your skin to shine if you want your skin to glow you have to be intentional about skincare yes and you have to be patient like i said you have to be patient you can't over the years i've i've tried out things for myself like there was a time there was a, the, okay there was a time i was using this um local brand like you know trying to support nigeria because when i when i came back to nigeria at some point i was just i just wanted to support nigerian brands so you know i would buy my products oh uh black black owned business kind of thing so i'll buy my products but a lot of them that i tried is either they're making you fair one week and then you start looking dark again or there's just something wrong like when i had issues with my face i went to this um a, a spa this she makes her products like what and i don't know what she calls herself though but she makes her skincare products and she owns the spa so i went there i got some of the stuff they were selling i started using it on my face my face became so fair like so bright so white like the difference you could see the difference between my face and my um, body like it was so obvious so out there man at some point my mom had to ask me what are you using in your face whatever you're using i think you should stop using it because it's making your face lighter than your body and of course it's, it wasn't a nice sight so i had to stop so this is not me condemning any nigerian brand they are very good ones these days <laughs> Like I can, there, there are some that I can honestly leave out for. Like there's, there are one or two that I know I've tried that they are really good. Um, I know Raw. It's a, it's, it's actually a brand. I think they are based in Kano, but okay, they have a, 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 a branch here in Abuja, I think. But they are based in Kano. But I've tried her skin care products Raw. And um, one thing is that, of course, one thing we just kind of stop is that they are pricey. If the good ones are always pricey, and that's just it because they use quality um, products. Is it um, raw materials or ingredients? Should I say they use quality ones, so they are usually pricey. Has is a bit pricey. I mean, not a bit. It's pricey, honestly. But then it's very good if it if it's if you want to uh, support a black-owned Nigerian-based business. I think that's one I can tell you gladly that it will work for you. Acne-prone, all of those things, whatever your skin concern is, raw will work for you. I know they are good like that. But like I said, take note of their prices. So if you go and see their price, well, I don't know, but I've tried it and you know, it has worked for me right now i'm taking a break on all of these products so what i'm using right now is what i'm going to tell you guys all about what i'm using and how it has worked for me so um i noticed that well me i love using oil that's number one thing i love using oil like i love to use oil on my skin but first yeah i just i just love using like whatever cream i'm using i have to have an oil so at some point i was using the fair and white oil but then it's now scarce in nigeria i don't know why it's scarce but it's scarce so my oil bio oil this oil has really helped me like it has really works for me i don't know how to um well it's just a normal oil i don't know if i should show you guys but it has a bit of when i say fragrance yeah it's a fragrance i guess but um see see how what it looks like so it has that glowy effect and um yeah it is easily absorbed can you see my skin so it also absorbs easily so this is the oil i'm using bio oil you can use bio oil you can use another oil but I, like i said it's a bit pricey so it's up to you uh but then i always use my oil with um a body lotion moisturizer any which one but um i'm using this body lotion by dr t i think i've showed you guys one of my vlogs when i bought it um so this is dr teal's vitamin c vitamin c yes 
moisture radiant citrus essential oils with cocoa butter shea butter and vitamin e so this is that's the um i use this particular cream and i think it's really nice it's not so pricey it's about four thousand um but it's really nice i have loved using it like i say using it last year around um november yes around november that was when i bought it that was the first time and since then i've been cons consistent with it one thing with skincare is consistency if you want to see results you have to be consistent so i've been consistent using this particular cream and my bio oil like um, so last year i was using fair and white oil but then like i said it's out of i don't know whether it's out of stock or they don't produce it anymore i don't know but yeah so i've been switching between bio oil and fair and white but since there's no more fair and white i'm just sticking with my bio oil for now and it's yeah it's working for me and one thing guys don't do the whole maybe you're looking for a lightning cream or like sorry like i said earlier when you have all these brands that promotes caramel skin white skin and all of those things you no know, skin lotion is skin lotion it's supposed to work for everyone one thing like i've said before is that you're beautiful in your skin whatever your color is you're beautiful in it like that so all you need to do is take care of it to look beautiful um this is my skin and i think i look beautiful in it but yes so uh, whatever your skin is you just need to take care of it to glue your skin just needs to be able to glue and that is all you need you do not need any lightening brightening all of this no it's okay to have brightening though um there are some basic ingredients if you want brightening because sometimes especially when you want to work on a scalp or something you have there are some certain um ingredients that you need in your um skincare like um you talk of kojic rc glutathione and all of those things it depends on what you want to use it for but some of these things are good and well so and then and that thing i want to talk about is exfoliating um so this is what can you see it's finished so this is the ex um exfoliant yeah this is the exfoliating cream i use though um body scrub thank you this is a body scrub i use this um apricot face and body scrub this eden with tamarind powder and licorice is it licorice or licorice licorice extract so this is the one i use this one so it's not so pricey it's about thirty thousand thirty five years um 35 yeah so that that's the body scrub i use guys you need to scrub if you want to have a glowing skin so i watched an interview of one um nollywood celebrity one time and she was asked uh what is it called now she was asked what's the secret to her skincare um to her skin and she was like you have to exfoliate and since then i took it serious like i exfoliate twice a week i exfoliate every tuesday and saturday if i don't exfoliate on tuesday then i exfoliate on wednesday but i make sure that tuesday or wednesday and on saturdays i make sure i exfoliate twice a week exfoliation works guys like i didn't believe it used to work until i started using it and then my skin has been fresh and all of that i used to have like especially my hand oh i yeah i've not painted my hand probably this week i'll do but then yes that's not the point but can you see my hand i used to i i mean i work at home i do all this um basic chores at home i used to feel like my hands were looking rough and dry it was just the way they were looking but i noticed that since i stay exfoliating my skin has been smoother not as soft as i would love it to be though but it is smooth it is clean like can you see so exfoliation works if you want to have a clean skin you have to exfoliate and consistency like i said do exfoliate once in two weeks or something mm -mm. make sure that um you exfoliate too some people say maximum three some people say maximum two i don't know but i just do twice a week and that's it for me so if you want to do just once a week make sure that you do you exfoliate every week once twice don't do more than three times Sha. that's too much but at least once or twice in a week, make sure you exfoliate your skin. If you want your skincare products to work for you, for your skincare products to work, you have to exfoliate. And exfoliation brings out, it's like, we know what it's all about. It's about um, scrubbing the dead skin, skin cells so that you're, uh, you reveal the uh, brighter, a better skin 
um, your body a bit um, more a fresher skin layer should i say because um after every how many days your skin this, the top layer shy, is just dead skin so you need to exfoliate it so that it, re it reels a brighter a smoother skin and when, 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 once you're exfoliating it makes your skin look brighter it makes your skin look more beautiful so you have to exfoliate 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 now exfoliation truth be told i don't have one i stick to, stick to or stick with um I just buy any nice one I see. Like I don't have a particular body scrub that I'm consistently using. But I just make sure that I get just get a good scrub. Scrubs can be expensive. The one I've been wanting to get is the three hots. I think it's like seven, eight thousand. And I'm like, mmm, just wait for now. But yeah, so and I'm using the one of three thousand thirty five and it's working. So the point is just get a good exfoliating scrub and scrub your your body once or twice a week um it doesn't well i think it matters but for now just get the one you can afford and use it and exfoliate and just get a good one there are so many good ones in market two, two five three thousand you get one and you consistently use it and the next one the next thing that i'm going to talk about that has worked for my skin guys this one i didn't even believe that it would work but it works like it works vitamin c <laughs> guys vitamin c works now i know um we see all the expo uh, the vitamin c thing that they say oh, vitamin c for um like you see my my my, my body lotion has vitamin c in it and i have um vitamin c serum for my face you know all of those things that people that we use but um take vitamin c now this one is new i just got it um just i think two days ago so so guys i know you notice the difference in my background um i'm in nigeria there was no light and they brought back light so it makes it's making the background brighter but yeah so as i was saying um vitamin c you have to learn to use vitamin c like vitamin c works so this is not the one i've been using though truthfully i've been using um there's this long one that you melt in water this long one i think i'll just put, insert a picture here of any any of the brands do not a particular brand i just buy any brand the one that you melt in water 1000 milligram I, i've been religiously taking it like i take it every single day so okay at once in a while i'll just miss a day or so but i've been taking i've been consistent with my vitamin c taking my vitamin c these days i'm trying to cut down a bit though because someone told me I, I don't know how true it is that it, you shouldn't have too much of it and i and i felt and they've taken back their light again but so yeah as i was saying um i noticed okay i used to take the um the melting one like i said the vitamin c 1000 milligram the one that you melt in water i used to take it but recently i started feeling like oh i'm getting tired of taking it it's beginning to feel like medicine like of course it's medicine but there was a way it was nice so i just enjoyed it but then recently it's beginning to taste um i don't know I, do, I don't like the taste anymore so i decided to get this one that i'll just swallow in water um this one is um vitamin c well see nature's field um i asked the pharmacist for one he was like i should get this one is very popular and that i can easily access this one so this one is like six nine uh vitamin c 1000 milligram it has um rose hip rose hip yeah rose hip and um um bioflavonoids it's a, it's a supplement right it's vitamin c with all these extra things inside but then yeah so vitamin c has really up like taking my skincare to another level like i can see the difference like my skin is brighter vitamin c works go and get vitamin c 1000 milligram the one in water the one i used to melt in water is like 2000 yeah so that's 2000 there so I remember my, I used to have this colleague that would tell me that, oh, when he's, he exposes himself too much to the sun, he takes vitamin C to get back his complexion. And I was thinking, eh, but since I started taking vitamin C, I took vitamin C serious, like from more of this year, actually. Vitamins, I like, I've seen the difference in my skincare. So I've seen the difference in my skincare. So guys, go and get yourself some vitamin C. It works another thing that i've been taking is um this um fish oil 
this one is good for the bones eye and hearts that's what they said but yes yeah, so fish oil that this one too has also helped because when i said taking it i bought this one and the normal with melting vitamin c i was taking them together like till it finished the one i bought before this is what it looks like so um this one is new i just started taking it so i've just taken it for two days now i just take one each day so i've just taken it for two days now but i bought the whole pack the last time i bought i just bought just one card like this and i finished it like i took it every day till it finished but i decided to get this one so that it will last i noticed the difference with this one too like i i think well this one is said it's good for the eyes so yeah i think it helps with my eyesight so i can't confirm that but i feel like my like i'm not i used to strain sometimes to look at something from my father i'm not doing that anymore so i think that's also helped that's not the only thing that has helped though but it has helped um and i noticed also my skin like i said there's a difference in my skin since i stay using it and when i stopped using it there's also a difference i feel like it um it helps with my acne and since i stopped using it um just kind of struggling with my face but yes it helps it, fish oil is just good just go and check the benefits of fish oil and try it and the latest addition to my supplements i don't take so many supplements though um it's the regular vitamin c that i've taken for a very long time and then this fish oil that i took for a while and stopped and then now i've gotten it back but this one i know a lot of you have seen this this is apple cider vinegar um gummies by golly yeah so this is um apple cider and anything that you know apple cider does this is what this is like a replacement because if you take apple cider i don't know about you but if anytime i take it i have this like um heart bone or something this is the way i feel and when i build it's like ew so i stopped taking it but since i got this one so it's a bit pricey though but yeah since i got it like i've been taking and i've seen a difference like especially in your digestive system it helps it aids digestion a lot like i don't feel bloated i my my like easy di digestion it just helps with digestion but not just that it helps with the skin it's apple cider it helps with the skin this one is with the mother they said right somewhere here with the mother so it's a supplement but it's apple cider so anything that apple cider does this does it now this one i got it when it was on promo i got it here in abuja one of the skincare shops i usually get my products from but yes this one i got it for nine five but the they were on sale like i said the original price is like twelve thousand twelve five they are about yes so but i got this one for um nine five and i'm loving it <laughs> like this one i don't feel to take it like i take it every single day you're supposed to take what they say one to six in a day but um this is what it looks like and it's really nice it's gum gummy so it's um chewy and it's really nice so i enjoy it so i take <laughs> i don't forget to take this one i love to so, yeah guys um these are some of the skincare products i've been using that has been working for me like i said everybody's skincare is, skin is different get what works for you one thing you should know is don't get a cream that like when I, I showed you guys my oh by the way my my um soap for my bathing soap if you've not seen two vlogs um ago i showed you guys the soap i use but it's still dr teal's um soothe and comforting i think um it has oat milk and um almond oat and almond milk so that's the one i use that's the uh, shower gel i use and then sometimes i use the e45 soap i mostly i use a shower gel in the morning and my soap at night but yeah that's it um just get good um good cream good soap that works don't don't look for don't try to look for oh okay i'm caramel skin so i have to get something caramel it's nothing like that or i'm light skin only if there's a particular thing you want to achieve and that one has that thing maybe you ha it has aha you want to clear some dark spot or you want to clear stretch mark or anything like that yes but if not honestly just go for regular just a nice moisturizer it's it's supposed to work for everybody it's not supposed to be a particular skin type kind of cream thing so yes i hope you've been able to learn one or two things in this video i hope you go and try it out and i hope it works for you even if there's nothing like i keep telling my sister she has to buy vitamin c my brother has bought his own too 
like even if you've not learned anything from this video two things you should go away with exfoliate even if it's once a week exfoliate take your vitamin c those two things you come back and tell me thank you like you will see the difference in your skin a week or two weeks you start seeing the difference so yeah i hope i've been able to help one or two persons to go and try something and see for themselves how their skin is going to glow so until my next video please like share and subscribe and thank you for all the support in all my videos please if you've not subscribed to my channel please do thank you it's going to help me to grow share with your friends and i want to grow this year my channel um and i hope um you learn one or two things and i well until next time take care of yourself